seriously need to do a video about how this product, Polish Choice, literally changed my face. I had so many little bumps on the middle of my forehead, like, and it wasn't like, like, yeah, I guess it was probably acne, but it wasn't, like, I wasn't able to do anything about it. Like, I would use certain kinds of creams, I would, like, wash, I would put pimple patches, I would even try to pop them, like, they weren't doing anything, and I did not understand what the problem was. I and mean, it was just getting really frustrated, and I was just, like, feeling bad about my skin. And actually, uh, our producer for the podcast, Jess, mentioned this product and was like, it literally is amazing. You should try it, see if it works out for you. And I tried it and like three days later, it was already working. And now I'm like, I need to refill. Actually, I will refill when I get to San Diego, which by the way, welcome back to another video. Today's gonna be a travel vlog. It's not gonna be long distance, but I'm traveling from LA to San Diego this weekend to celebrate my dad's birthday and just spend time with my family this weekend. So that is what we'll be doing today. We're gonna hop on the train to LAX with my dream, oh my God, again. Okay, like this video and you enjoy this kind of content, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, share, all the things that you do. Yeah, so anyways, I live by this product, like literally, this is gonna be like holy grail. Like if I have to recommend a product to anybody, it's gonna be this and it's gonna be any survey face wash cleanser, like any one of those. I try the hydrating one because I have dry skin, but I've literally not heard anything bad said about any of this pro any of these products i even use the uh healing ointment i use all of that so cerave and polish choice exfoliate period so when i travel long or short um i don't really wear makeup unless i'm like traveling getting off of said transportation and then going to a place that i need to go to like an event or something my mom's just picking me up <laughs> from the train station and then we're gonna go home so i'm just gonna wear mascara and eyebrows i want to do the feathered brow look i just don't think i'm there yet mentally and physically i will say i grew up with the block brow era you know that 2014 to 2016 situation and i no longer use dip brow but i want to do the feather brow but i'm like so i just <sighs> I'm not there yet, so I'm, I'm on the transition from block brow to feather brow. I'm somewhere in the middle right now. So I'm only going to be there for the weekend and like an extra day, so I'm not really bringing that much stuff. Like This has all my makeup and jewelry in it, tampons, because I literally started my period this morning. Love that for me. Obviously toothbrush, toothpaste, deodorant, perfume, and I'm bringing my Confident Kind Handsful Heartful to put all of that in. And then over here, I have my adidas duffel bag with my clothes and bags in it i'm also gonna be taking my laptop because i need to edit and stuff but other than that that's pretty much it for the traveling outfit i have yet to master the not wearing sweats traveling thing i haven't mastered that don't know if I ever will, so sweatpants, these are for Forever 21. This is from either Nasty Gal or ASOS, I cannot remember, I've had it for a while. Um, and then I'm just gonna wear my new high top white converse. That's the fit, I'm also gonna wear these. So these are also from ASOS, my everyday jewelry, my traveling fit, and I will be taking my Cal Pack fanny pack. This is the best fanny pack I've ever owned. My mom got it for me, obsessed, thanks mom. Yeah. Cute. Love. Feeling young, but they treat me in the dirt that they do on my name turn to soil and i grew up by it time for y'all to figure out what y'all gonna do about it big wheels keep rolling rolling i'm outside 29 g5 seaside i've been losing friends and finding peace Participate in the opportunity tickets drawing. A $20 ticket purchase gets you a 
Also, it's us not listening. It's fine. The show's not started yet, so. <laughs>